I'm here with the GeneralSports.com Athlete of the Week, Max Strayler of the men's cross-country team. Mac, you won the individual ODAC championship on Saturday by over 18 seconds. Take us through that race. It, uh, for the first two kilometers of a four, well, it's a, there's four loops, each is two kilometers for the race, and, uh, for the whole first lap, it was, like, really slow pace, um, which is usually how it goes out in championship races, because no one wants to really take the lead and risk getting, uh, risk falling behind later in the race, and, um, you know, to me, starting out slow is kind of a nightmare, because I, I don't have the best closing speed, so... Uh, if I'm going to run well, I usually have to put some distance between me and other uh, faster competitors early on. So I tried to make a move at around like 2,500 meters or so, and I just kind of thought the whole pack was going to speed up, but instead I just made a lot of room for myself. And after that, I just I kind of held a lead for a really long time until the end. Okay. You were named the runner of the year for the win, earned your fourth first-team All-ODAC honor, and were named the scholar-athlete of the meet for the second year in a row. How special was it to win the race and take home those honors in your senior year? I mean, it it, it was a really great feeling, and uh, yeah, it's a very happy, uh, I'm sure it'll be a very happy memory for me from, you know, my like eight years of running now. That That's probably one of my better days, I think. Um, you know, I think it might have not been so great if we hadn't won as a team, but the team uh, ran you know, together better than I ran individually. So that was sort of the big takeaway was that we, you know, we managed to repeat and were uh, ODAC champions for the second time in a row. But, yeah, I guess the icing on the cake was that, uh, I mean, the runner of the year thing, that that means a lot. So I'm really, I'm really grateful to have that too. Okay. And finally, you mentioned the team also won the ODAC title and you guys next compete at the NCAA regional, regionals on November 19th. What are your expectations for that meet? Uh, we've we've kind of had the same goal for well we had the same goal last year which was uh, to put together a regionals performance as a team that would qualify us for nationals and uh, in most cases you have to finish top two in the region but uh, we've we've had such a strong regular season that we think we could qualify for nationals with a third place finish as well um, although that's definitely uh, not no guarantee. Uh, but I think that I think that at this point the team would think of anything less than third place at regionals as sort of a disappointment, and um, I think on our very very good days we we do have a shot at cracking top two and maybe putting together like a really special uh, special race for the team, doing something we haven't done in a long time. Okay, thanks, Mac. Thanks.